Okay, we've got the Arlington Admirals number four in the Tully Runners ratings uh, preseason coming in, and they look pretty massive in impression today. And uh, somebody, uh, I think, went under 16 here today, was it? So, sounds pretty good. So, anyways, coming in for the names from everybody. Stephen Gray, Jack Palusio, Akash Bangu, Brian Palusio. Nice Abadar, J.B. Ramirez Valencia, Arsenio Nachayev. Okay, Ethan, uh, you know, summer is always 100 degrees, 100% humidity, and you got to watch yourself, because, you know, kids get carted off in the ambulances here today. But, so, thinking going in, you know, the conditions were getting pretty tough by, you know, the, the D3 time and everything. So when you started the race, is there anything you had to do to, uh, you know, get through on a day like this? First thing I had to do was get out of the corner. Decided to put in alphabetical order. So we were in the back corner of the race, starting off, probably in the worst position out of everybody. You're down this side or that side? All the way back. On the right. On the right. Side. So we had a long side. We had the long run around. Oh! So I started off in the back. Uh, it took me a minute to catch up. I probably caught up around the tree line. Yeah. And um, I didn't really do much mentally. Uh, I don't really think about it too much. I kind of beat you up if you think yeah. about it. That's what happens. Like, yeah. Yeah, you don't want to waste mental, you know, it, today is such a draining day, you don't want to waste mental energy on too much, Just, but getting through is, is important, and, and getting that, in that last quarter mile, you need to uh, save something just to get over the line in good shape. So what's up, I mean, obviously next week is off for everybody, uh, you know, and everything, and after that for Arlington, uh, what's, what's big within the next two to... Weeks to a month or so. The biggest race we got is probably Manhattan. Mm -hmm. uh, before states, of course, and sectionals. Yeah. Uh, there's not really many huge races between then and there. Yeah. I guess you said counties would be all right. But catch them there. Catch them as you probably gonna catch them. They're underrated for sure. They keep working out a boat, and you see their times on support you every once in a while. Yeah, yeah. Um, they've they've got a couple and. Uh, Oh gosh, the top girls runner. She uh, did she graduate? No, she's a junior. She's a junior. She's a junior. Uh, Abby. 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 Yeah, because yeah. yeah. Oh, she's still only. Do you say she's only a junior? Yeah. Whoa. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> they still have Connor too. Yeah, they got Connor Hayes senior. Oh, wow. Okay, so they've got some some good anchors, you know, for you to. Uh, um, any competition from Carmel or anything up there this year as much? No. 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 We, uh, we worked really hard, our, our team's came from fall. We were uh, probably the worst starting off coming to freshman year. We were probably the worst rated team. We worked very hard for this. We're very, we are. You weren't the worst rated team. You were. You had slipped bad. back. No, yeah, we you know, really compared. Wild. Yeah. Why to get back up? Yeah, we were yeah. really bad. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, things had fallen. But you know, you're talking about COVID times, right? Yeah. You know, yeah. So, uh, it was impossible. No one was doing rankings, ratings, and rankings Our then best because guy it was, was 17, 18 guy. Right. Our best guy was not. Uh, he yeah, was, he no. even make varsity now. He even make varsity you're, you're, you're right. It was uh, it was a bad time for Arlington, but it was a bad time for a lot of teams back then. It was a lot to come. And I think everybody's pretty much back in track. Uh, I think the pole vault uh, will still take a little bit of time to get back because you know some of the uh, some events like that take a while. But uh, in cross country, guys should be pretty much set now. You know, and everything. And uh, you guys are. Uh, the great hope for Section 1 this year in Class A, because there's always those tough teams, but, um, you know, Fairport and, you know, all these uh, uh, good teams up there, you know, and everything. But uh, good luck going ahead. We'll be catching you many time. I'm hoping maybe even get to Northern Counties if you can schedule it for a, uh, you know, a day that's uh, more workable um, than... Uh, then you've done it in the past, you know, and everything. But um, oh, my bad again. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's just you know, it's it's usually on the day of another county meet, you know, and everything I, I like for, that. For when the day's going, so I'll, I'll make sure this time. Okay, we'll, yeah, we'll, get we'll get, get it. it on like a Wednesday. No one ever has a county meet on a Wednesday, you know, and everything. So. We'll, we'll keep it in mind. But, okay, okay. Well, the admirals, good luck going ahead. Uh, we'll be catching you many places along the road. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you.